let's go. Hello. So today I'm going to be running through doing some testing for a Hilux that's had a rear disc brake conversion. Here you can see an exploded view of the new disc brake setup. These are some thermal photos from before testing. All of the testing was done at Cessnock Airport. All of the braking data was recorded on a V-Box. V-Box is the gold standard for data acquisition for engineers. Here you can see the V-Box turning on. The V-Box has got a pedal sensor connected to the brake pedal. Here you can see some of the information that is displayed to the driver while testing. Here Ryan is recording the thermal images of the brake temperatures. And here Blake is recording the distances to the cameras from the start line. Distance to the first camera, 25.9, round it to 26 metres. We do this so that all the testing is the same before and after. Distance to the second camera, 51.6 metres. First I'm going to run through the unmodified testing. Okay, so now that all the before testing's done, we're going to take it to Petters and get the rear brakes converted. Okay, so we're back at Cessnock Airport for the after modification testing. I've had the rear brakes converted to disc. I've also had the front brakes, the suspension and a wheel alignment done, but I've kept the original tires so the tests can be comparable.
As you can see, there was a massive increase in braking performance and stopping distance. It ended up being between 17.5 and 17.8% pretty consistently, from 30 kilometers an hour all the way up to 100 kilometers an hour. This is what some of the data off the V-Box looks like, recording all the brake stops. And this is some of the thermal imaging camera photos. This video was not sponsored by Petters, but I'd like to thank the guys at Petters Gosford and Tugra for a good job done and for allowing us to video while it was being completed. So before you complete any brake modifications, give me a call to discuss your options and to find out what is required to sign off your modification or go to my website.